There are many ways we do this. Preaching what we don't practice. This brings apostasy. Many youths don't stay in the churches because they don't see we living and practicing what we preach to them. Hypocrisy is lying to people about our fellowship with the Lord. There are many ways to do this. Preaching what we don't practice, praying things we don't mean, and pretending to do what we don't do. That's a small test. We close from church. A lady approached me to complain about marital issues. Oh, my bon payama. How many of us immediately will get home? Call our family and pray for them. But when we come to Christ, he doesn't care about your past. Once I was a sinner, saved by grace. He just put off your dirty clothing and puts on you his righteousness. So seated here, there is nobody who is an evil person. Because of the finished work of Christ, we have become the righteousness of God. So wherever I am, people must see that Jesus is here. And with me the righteousness should be the standard. Because I represent Christ. Change your hearts and change your life. Sometimes people can say, people say, you have to shock him to wait. God looks at the heart. Yeah. That's not your neighbor. It's 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 not your neighbor. We want to see. Let's defend your neighbor. It's not your neighbor. Because you are working among human beings, we want to see. So Zacchaeus like says, yes, I've encountered, but I know in my community, I've cheated people. So I'm going back. Please take your money back. You were supposed to pay five Ghana. I took 20. Now I've met Jesus. That is repentance. What is left undone, which you are supposed to do to be righteous people? God, what should I do? To be counted as a righteous person, not the clerical, not the position as the general secretary. For that is by ordination. But to be able to sit on that throne and administer justice fairly in the church calls for a righteous heart. If you fail in that, 